What's going on guys? It's Omni York and today I'm bringing you a brand new video where I'm going to be spinning the Alexander the Great Wheel for the last time in Rise of Kingdoms. Now when we migrated into this new kingdom, I knew that I had three Alexander the Great Wheels lined up ahead of me and I posted the first one here on YouTube. This second one came around when I wasn't feeling so well and I recorded some footage, but the, the spins weren't that great. So I figured you guys wouldn't want to see two of them pretty close back to back, but here we are this is the third one we're gonna hope that we get some really great luck with this wheel because again this is the final alexander the great wheel for this kingdom and we're also getting really close to expertising Yi song ye so maybe we can do that in this video depending on how many universal sculptures we do actually get now if you guys want to know if alexander the great is a commander that is worth spinning the wheel for this many times then go ahead and check out my first alexander wheel video where i explain why i think alexander is so good and why i think he's at least worth summoning on the wheel if not spinning even more all right now let's get this free spin out of the way because it's it's really bothering me i want to see that free spin we land right off the bat this is a good start okay we got one sculpture of alexander completely for free so that's amazing let's go in and i want to look at how many sculptures exactly do we have of universal so we have 59 uni universal uh legendary commander sculptures which means there's a super high chance that we expertise Esong in this video i can't see why not next i want to go ahead and see how many sculptures do we have right now of alexander the great now my alexander is five four zero zero he is you know pretty behind in terms of alexander i'm i'm fully aware of that but i'm working on it guys i'm working on it so right now we have 20 alexander the great sculptures which means we had 19 when the video started we just got one for free so as long as we get 20 alex sculptures then we're going to be bringing him all the way to four stars because i think that makes the most sense now of course we have to do the half off spin you always know you got to do the half off so let's see what we get for half off it's 400 gems we get two uh dazzling starlit sculptures not something that i really need at the moment but maybe down the line i will actually need them what kind of alliance is that what what is going on there anyway let's spin this five times let's just get the ball rolling let's see what we do let's see how many sculptures we can get right off the bat we land on research speed ups we don't need those all we have left is t5 siege we do get one sculpture of alexander we do get the training speed ups which we do need because we're very low we get the stars and we get another sculpture of alexander so there we go we're getting two right off that five spin and the training speed ups we did need those so that's good let's go ahead and spin this again let's see what we get from this five spot we get another training speed ups which is good again we're in kvk we need that we don't need the building speed ups that's the worst thing that we can get the stone is okay i've used a lot of stone training same thing with wood i'm low on resources building speed ups again absolute trash so this was not a very good spin nothing here is very useful of course the resources are okay um and the the training speed ups is, is good right we do need that let's go ahead and claim our free five alexander sculptures i guess they're not really free because i did spend gems um really quick if you guys didn't see any of my other alexander videos or any alexander videos from anybody else um this first extra reward is for 10 spins you get five sculptures for 25 spins you get five universals for 45 spins you get 10 alex for 70 spins you get 10 universals and for 100 spins you get 15 alex now there's other also some other goodies in here obviously the speed ups and the resources things like that but really the reason that you spin these wheels is primarily for the sculpture so let's keep spinning we're going to do another five spin to see what happens we see where it lands we get the stars again in the future we may need those but we don't need them now same thing with the with the food we've got plenty of food we get the universal which is good that's going to go to esong we're going to use that for esong yay that's totally fine we get the alex and we get two alex so that's a good that's a good spin i'm, I'm going to take that and um, we get three legendary commander sculptures for 3600 gems not going to complain there at all let's do another five spin to see what we get this time hopefully we land on the eight spot that's really like that's the sweet one that's the one that you want the most um we got some i don't remember what the first one was we got 45 hours of speed uh 45 hours of speed ups universal which is nice we did get an alex and we did get a universal there so those 45 hours are definitely good value um really like that we really like these sculptures and then these uh the resources obviously we're going to use them but nothing super important in there let's do another five spin which pushes pushes us over the 25 spin requirement we landed on alexander we landed on the eight spot baby let's go that's what we wanted that's what i wanted to see that's what i like to see boys and girls i love it i love it i love it and we got what oh my god dude we got whole 
we got 11 alexander the great sculptures from that spin that was incredible value incredible value um we probably can already put a scale on alexander especially because we're gonna grab this these are universals but regardless we probably could already put another uh, skill on him um if we had to maybe maybe i'm not sure we're probably close if not let's keep spinning because we do have to get as many of these as we can and there we go we got another one i love to see it alexander's the boy we got another single one let me get that eight spot real quick let me get that eight spot yo come on come on come on let's get the eight oh we don't want to see the building speed ups that's not what we want man oh no so we got the building speed ups and the research speed ups not good for me maybe good for you if you're if you're spinning the wheel and it's the early game maybe those are things that you absolutely are going to need these are actually really great value if you calculate um, how many hours of speed up speed ups this is and you figure out how many gems you spent on that so essentially you take 3600 you divide that by five that's essentially what this is worth and you can kind of do the math so this is what eight times four is uh 32 so 32 hours of speed ups divided by you know however many gems divided by 32 hours you get the idea you can figure out how many gems per hour it is and in general if it's if it's about i would say 35 gems per hour or less um or even 30 gems per hour or less is really good value um i think that comes in at a, at a really good price for me useless so let's keep spinning let's see what we can do here we got 25 spin chances left after this we get two golden stars not really something that we're looking for here we're looking for the sculptures but we got the 45 hours which is nice i'll take the 45 hours that's certainly a, a runner-up for a good deal we definitely don't want the building those are absolutely useless again with the stars we don't really need that we got no sculptures for this one this was not a good spin um really the only thing i'm excited about there is the 45 hours which is basically just training speed ups for me at this point but regardless let's keep spinning i want to see what we get there's the alexander we love the boy we love to see it we get more stars the stars love me i don't know what's going on there but we get the universal and i like the universal again the universal is basically an isong yay sculpture for me so that's awesome we got uh, two universals and an alexander i'll take that and we got the 45 so that's absolutely a good spin right there now again we're looking for that eight spot that's what we want more than anything we want the eight spot because man it's just such a good value it's only a two percent drop chance of getting that eight spin i know that the wheel looks like it's divided into eight or i'm sorry 12 even areas but in reality there's not an even chance of landing on all of them so what do we get here we got two alexander and a universal and some resources so again a good spin i'll take it three sculptures is a nice uh drop rate for a single five spin let's go ahead and claim our 45 sp spin uh reward which is 10 alexander the great sculptures absolutely worth it absolutely worth it now before we proceed any further i do want to show you guys i feel obligated to show you the probability of this drop chance that way you guys don't feel like you should be spending this many gems on the wheel absolutely not make sure that if you guys are spending in this game spend responsibly of course um this is a lot of gems that i'm spending which converts into a lot of real life dollars so if you guys you know don't go crazy with gems and spending okay these are the probability the probability is pretty low of getting that eight spot um it's again it's not an even uh it's not an even 12 boy split okay let's keep spinning here see what we get the odds are low that we get the eight spot but we want it and we don't want those we don't want those research speed ups man we just we really don't want it but again if you guys are in the early game the wheel is actually a great way to get some of these speed ups because again it is actually pretty good value pretty good value for what you're spending essentially this is 22 and a half gems per hour which is better than the vip shop right the vip shop if you buy the eight hour amount it's eight hours of speed ups for 240 gems that comes out to about 30 gems per hour so right here these are better than the vip shop so if you need these don't feel bad about getting them in the wheel you should actually feel really good about getting them in the wheel because again they are better value than the vip shop speed ups but again for me i want the sculptures man i want the sculptures and you know if that's probably why most people spin the wheel is for the sculptures we got the alexander right there which is what we're looking for we got the research speed ups not what we want but the universal is good we'll take the universal that's basically e song we got the wood that's okay we already had some wood terrible joke anyway we three sculptures in that one is is great right we got the universal i'll take it um Esong is going to be expertise you guys he's going to be expertise um so i don't know what i'm going to use the rest of these universals on because he's absolutely hitting the, the expertise which i'm super excited about it's taken forever um we only got one alex so far in this spin. we got two alex so far can we get the eight spot come on no we got the gold we only got one eight spot in 60 spins or 62 spins sorry um, but we did get a ton of sculptures so we still have 11,000 gems. I'll take it. That's totally cool. Um, I did end up buying the $50 Dragon Bolt bundle. So that's kind of where some of those gems came from. So if you guys were wondering, let's go ahead and claim this. Now, let's look at the 
legendary commander sculptures that we have because this is important okay this is important let's look at e song really quick so we have 70 out of 80. now i have a surprise for you guys in a minute so we're gonna expertise e song in this video I, a little spoiler okay we're gonna expertise song e song right here right now you're gonna see it i'm stumbling over my words i i swear i'm only drinking water so i don't know what's going on there but anyway we are at 61 sculptures so we went from 19 to 61 let's go ahead and upgrade we've got the next skill on our boy alexander so let's go ahead and level him up we're gonna get him all the way to four stars in this video now the way that i like to star up commanders if i want to if i want a huge amount of, of of this star xp all in one upgrade is i do two of these bundles and then i do four of these uh i don't actually know what these ones are called are these like they're not i don't know i don't know what the, they're blessed i think they're called blessed i believe um so if you do two of the bundles and four of the blessed what this is going to do is this only has a five percent crit chance but it gives you 800 experience this one has a 20 percent crit chance which is double the regular one 20 percent and it still gives you a lot of experience so essentially what what you're doing here is you're getting a ton of experience but you're still also almost guaranteed to get that crit so let's go ahead and develop and we'll see what happens we'll see where it goes and there it is so we got almost we were all so close so close so we do have to level him up a bit which isn't a bad thing i mean alexander is a commander that's you know he's 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 still pretty good even at five five one one so if i had to bring him to 60 it wouldn't be the worst thing ever but let's go ahead and level him up i do have a lot of experience saved up here so we're just going to get him all the way there um I, I don't know maybe i'll use him as a primary one day maybe i won't i'm not really sure um but let's go ahead and just push him all the way up because i've been saving experience i didn't really know who i was saving it for but i'm glad that i have it now i don't want to i don't want to exceed we don't want to exceed no we don't want to do that we want to be responsible here with our um with our we don't want to do that we'll do that and then we'll finish it off with some uh hundos and there we go all right so we got 10 talent points i don't really know what i want to do with him yet so i'm actually not going to push too far into this um I, I i have a talent build in mind but i want to review it really quick off off video before i do anything so here we're going to just use the regular stars to get him the rest of the way um because i don't really know if i'm gonna take if i'm gonna take him all the way to six stars yet because really if he's six stars i should probably expertise him and i'm really far away from that so i don't want to commit to that yet let's just go ahead and see if we can get him to there it is okay we unlocked all of his skills so there we go we have a 5511 alexander now I, that's probably not where i'm gonna leave him i'm probably gonna invest more in him in the future i do have enough you know legendary universals to push him a little bit farther right now but i promised we would do that for esong so the surprise in this video is that i actually have 150 bamboo leaves and you can see here that i'm guaranteed 10 legendary commander sculptures as long as these 150 can get me to the next level and guys it's guaranteed it's gonna happen let's see how far these 150 get me but if anything it's definitely gonna get me the 10 universal legendary commander sculptures for the next level so i'm super excited there it is baby there's the 10 universal legendary commander sculptures which means he song Ye is finally expertise he's finally expertise how are we gonna are we gonna get to uh halfway there more than halfway there there we go i love to see that um we really are shooting for this level 25 but we are so so far away um we've got only a couple of days left to finish this event and I've, I've been working a lot it's been hard for me to grind barbs i feel like i've been getting less boxes from barbs than previous events i don't know if anybody else is experiencing that but i'm getting a, i'm getting a worse drop rate than i feel like i've gotten prior so i don't know maybe that's a conspiracy theory but anyway guys girls this is the moment that i've been waiting for for so long let's do it Ising, Ising Ye. finally the elusive the coveted the true legendary the og the archer og there he is we officially have an expertise Ising, Ising Ye. why do i mess up saying that word every single time i mess up his name every single time this is it this is what we've been talking about in videos that circular area he's a monster he's an he's a monster and now he's ours he's expertise we've got that shiny gold stars floating around my boy e song man i feel like i have enough experience to x to get him to level 60. i don't know if i want to do that i don't think that he's great as a primary because we've talked about this in other videos but regardless this has been quite the video we've got a 551 alexander we've got an expertise e song Ye. and 
we've got 15 gold keys so why don't we pop some gold keys why not we're on a roll let's pop some gold keys let's see what happens we're gonna do them one at a time okay let's do one gold key let's see what we get we're looking for martell okay there already dude what i already got martell it's only two sculptures so nothing crazy but that's what i'm looking for baby that's what let's, let's see more of you my guy let's see more of you buddy i want to summon you let's summon a martell in this video can you believe that if we got a 551 alexander an expertise song and a summon of martell in 15 keys is it possible can we do it i don't think so but i'm really hoping i you know what i feel i feel like the last key we're gonna get a summon of martell what do you guys think drop a thumbs up on the video if you think we're gonna get a summon of martell if you could just feel it if you can feel it in your soul that we're gonna get a summon of martell drop a thumbs up we got six keys left he didn't show up in that one we didn't get in that one come on man we need some legendary oh my god i thought it was it was a summon i thought it was it was it was martell i thought he heard me okay we're getting more of these we're getting a ton of ton of uh, stars this this video i don't know what's happening okay we got cleopatra listen four legendary commander sculptures from 15 gold keys i'll, I'll take it okay but this is the last key is this going to be a summon of martell i can't even look i can't even look I didn't hear him. I didn't hear Martel. I knew. Okay. The video could only be so good, right? It could only be so good. What were the odds that I got a, a summon of Martel? It was like less than 1% chance. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I think we've got a ton of things accomplished in just a short amount of time. We got an expertise to Isong A. We got a 551 Alexander. And, you know, he might be the next commander that I continue to focus on. I'm not really sure. I think it might be worth it. He's a, he's a powerhouse. I mean, he's amazing. Now, the next thing we're going to be focusing on I, I don't know i might i might spin this alexander wheel all the way to the end i might get the hundred spins i think i'm going to i feel it i feel like we're going to do that but also vip 14 is right around the corner now i know what you're thinking omniarch you should just gem this because every day that you don't gem it you're missing out on a legendary commander sculpture and i know that however right now recharge event is happening and my alliance is spending money right they're spending money sorry that's not the right spot this is where recharge event is um my alliance is spending money um and i'm getting a lot of vip every single day and i'm i'm spending a little bit of money every single day as well so you know i'm getting vip naturally i want to see how much vip do i get before this recharge event is over and then once it is then i'll gem the rest of the way i'm just trying to be a little bit more responsible with my gem spending i don't want to just gem the whole thing right away you know i know it's I know I should, but I'm, I'm being responsible with my gems. So with that being said, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a thumbs up on it and comment down below. If you have any questions about Alexander the Great or the Wheel of Fortune or the Order of the Commanders or anything like that, I'll be happy to answer any questions for you guys down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here and click the bell to be notified the next time that I upload a Rise of Kingdoms video. As always, my social media links are in the description below as well as my Discord and my Twitch link. So go ahead and drop a follow on my Twitch as well. I typically stream Rise of Kingdoms at least once or twice a week where we hang out, listen to music, and we do all sorts of cool stuff. I have a fog machine as well. I don't know if you guys know this, but I do have a fog machine right here that I let uh, my twitch chat interact with so it's it's a good time um, I have color changing lights it's it's fun hopefully you guys will stop by in some stream in the future and and I'll be happy to see you there there's also a link down below to download rise of kingdoms for blue stacks on your PC that's how I play the game and I really enjoy it so make sure you check it out it is free and I think it's the best way to play during kvk that's just my experience and with all that out of the way guys thank you so much for watching this has been Omniarch. I will talk to you guys again soon peace